dear students in this module we are going to talk about the types of available drugs classifying drugs by chemical similarities is useful because of their somewhat similar impacts and risks associated with the health an individual who is addict to the drugs is more likely to abuse or to be abused if it is chemically similar identical or it can produce different effects if the chemicals are different so the same treatment is often effective for chemically identical drugs so let's see that what are the similarities and differences of these drugs the number one is alcohol most widely abused substance across the world is alcohol it is legal in number of countries across the globe and alcohol creates the feeling of euphoria and lower inhibition like beer wine and liquor are the most common examples of alcohol however in pakistan alcohol is officially uh, not allowed is officially banned but yet it is considered that alcohol is unofficially or illegally being consumed in pakistan so here is the glimpse of alcohol and then we have the opioids they are called the opiates they are derived from the drug opium or the chemicals designed to mimic it opioids are the work by interacting with the neurotransmitters in the brain it also is used as a serious painkiller opioids are some of the most addictive of all noun substances uh, in common uh, form these opioids are available as uh, heroin uh, fentanyl uh, oxycodone so here is one of the opioids then we have the benzodiazepines benzos are a class of drugs that function by interacting with neurotransmitter uh, which is gamma uh, gamma amino boitric acid uh, which is commonly known as uh, gaba each benzo impacts the body differently and benzos are prescribed to treat a wide variety of psychiatric uh, disorders as well as uh, sleep disorder conditions benzos are considered to be highly addictive examples of benzos can include ativon uh, volium and uh, exanex So here is one of the examples of benzos and then we have the cannabinoids cannabinoids create the feeling of elated and being uh, elated and in the situation state of ecstasy and uh, negatively it impacts the mental functioning and body functioning as well it is most widely used drugs after alcohol uh, it is considered less addictive than the other drugs classifications examples of cannabinoids include hashish and marijuana so here you see the uh, one of the examples of cannabinoids then we have the barbiturates barbiturates are uh, act on the central nervous system by slowing down its functioning used for anesthesia and treatment of epilepsy and severe headache these are considered highly addictive substance 
and common examples include amitol and luminol. So these are the different types of drugs which are identified and classified.